so just like a lot of songs on on this new record um thank god for the bomb started with a video that cliff took on his phone um playing the guitar riff and uh and another riff too because it was so early in the recording or the writing process it kind of set the tone for where the album was going to go in terms of just being more of a straightforward rock and roll album and kind of I don't want to say getting away from the the bubblegum pop punk stuff that Huntington's have done, you know, over the course of the career, but it was more along the lines of just a tougher sound and kind of just a more hard charging sound. So uh, I started writing Thank God for the Bomb, I think uh, fall of 2018. Mike and I were just kind of talking about we were, we were thinking in terms of um, where we wanted the record to go, and we both really were thinking, uh, well, initially we were thinking maybe, because we had been playing, the band had been playing a lot of darker material, kind of a hard, kind of a tough kind of presentation, like the Get Lost stuff, but we wanted it to be um, more along the lines probably of like Adios Amigos, and especially Mondo Bizarro, and... When I heard that, I was just like, oh, okay. So I just kind of like picked up my guitar and I just started, I just started, I just started playing guitar. And like within like a minute, um, like most of the main parts of that song just came across. And I was like, oh, this is really, really good. So I just set up my phone and I just recorded it. I don't know how many videos Cliff sent us of him like in his pajamas or underwear or whatever, like. Hey guys, here's a cool riff I came up with. All right guys, here's a song that Mike and I wrote. Um, I kind of sent him a general outline, then he came up with a chorus, changed the chorus idea I had, made it really cool. This comes together great, just sounds like something we do. Fresh, awesome, here we go. So that song really set the tempo for where we wanted to take this musically. And reworking it and reworking it. Um, but it fit really good with like an idea I had about a song that could kind of like tell a little bit of a story about the band, just the band's outlook on where we are now, where we came from, tying it back to the whole Allison's the Bomb uh, thing from, you know, long ago. <laughs> So we're doing vocals today and Mike decided to wake up and write all the lyrics. Mike wrote a lot of lyrics the day of in the studio uh, and I had to write some solos the day of. Was, uh, this one in particular, we I, I think I wrote it a day or two before. I recorded it on my phone and sent it to Mike and he was like, yeah, good, do that. You know, other ideas come up while we're in the studio and it's like, this song's called Thank God for the Bomb. I was like, we need a we need a bomb to go off. We need a, you know, we gotta build up on the drums here. Let's just like just do it. Do another. This is what the roll would be. Yeah. Is that good? Alright, here we go. just kind of like an appreciation song to kind of thank everybody for either the people who have been there from the beginning, the people who called on late, people who are maybe just going to catch on now with this song. Um, and um, even up until we recorded it, uh, we were passing along iPhone videos of ideas for, you know, what to do with it. And even after it was recorded and Josh was in the studio laying down guitar tracks, I sent him a quick video of a of a lead that just to kind of throw in the in the mix there and kind of just fill in some space. Yeah, I think I was like driving to the studio to record other guitar parts like for different songs and Mike uh, sent me a message like, hey, I got this idea for this one little part and thank God for the bomb. After the song was recorded, it really didn't grab me until uh, Mike went back, or I'm sorry, Josh went back and um, kind of brought it all together with the cool little leads over the last chorus and um, 
when Mike, you know, we finally heard Mike's lyrical structure for the song. If you have time, try and squeeze in this weenie nee 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 ear. So yeah, we did a lot of that, this whole, like I'm doing right now, filming things on a phone. Um, but yeah, hopefully, hopefully all that work turns out good and people enjoy it and thank God for the bomb. I love this song. This is actually one of my favorite songs on the record, the way it sounds, the meaning behind it, the energy, everything about the song. I absolutely love it. And I just can't wait to start playing it live. It's one of those songs. It's one of my favorite songs on the album. And I think it's going to be a, a set list standard for a very long time. And I'm very excited about that. Song called Thank God for the Bomb? Yep. All right. Good. One, two, three, four.